not all who wander are lost. Oh my god! Oh! Matthew Trapp, Sarah Dust, and Epic Mob successfully ambush and kill Katie Simone, the Lightning Brony, and Laverly. Oh! This was a lot more painful than I thought. I'm seeing people who support my content being slaughtered. What have I done? Vad the Vampire receives a hatchet from an unknown sponsor. So you're telling me the T-Rex Vampire now has a hatchet? I think he is the only thing to stop Yoda from stabbing people like a ninja. <laughs> I feel like I am literally the only person that will find this absolutely funny for the few people that get this. Um, I may have at one point made a joke that AJ constructed a mansion out of crack cocaine, thus a crack mansion. I guess old habits die hard. <laughs> Oh, boy. Also, AJ doesn't actually have a crack problem, but I have an ass problem. Not like, I don't have like a ass fissure problem. I, I mean, I'm, a, I'm an asshole. Matt Tardis searches for a water source. Robert Smith explores the arena. Oh, my gosh. Nine deaths in the first day i i don't know if this is the most amount of deaths uh in one day right if you want to do a little research but this is a huge amount for the first day dfpg david shore gabriel escobar bobo ender little miss rarity katie lightning brony and laverly are all dead does that take any district out? District 2 is gone. Laverly's district and Ender's district are gone. <laughs> the Bruni district is gone. That's a that's a sad fact. Apparently, the, the power of Pinkie Pie from Season 2 did not give them the power they needed. Um, but I guess if anyone can live on their legacy, it's Knox. What I feel bad for is, like, half of these people are like, I got a partner. And they're just like, I don't want to be their partner. <laughs> That's really, really dark. I'm gonna be honest, I feel like my biggest fear is those people who, who did the suicide pack are depressed in real life, and this is a really terrible thing. Night one. Evil Pickle Rick attempts to start a fire, but is unsuccessful. That's freaking creepy as shit, because, guys, I gotta move this. Look at this. What the frick? What the frick? Listen, get the cameras out of my house, Pickle Rick. I will not turn into your communist ways. Disturbed Gamer screams for help. Can someone get me an all-timey bomb? <sighs> Robert Fenn's Van the Vampire Seer Dust and Froggy Otaku away from his fire. <laughs> you! Get away from my fire, you giant T-Rex anime character and girl with dog. Just cut like a stick. Back. Back off all you. Which, by the way, I thought Robert killed them all. Because every time I see multiple faces, I feel a panic attack. Which I'm going to feel a panic attack right now because there's multiple faces underneath this. <gasps> I haven't read it. Let's just all read it together. Roxanne, Matt Tars Knox, and Matthew Tars tell each other ghost stories, lighting the mood. You know, I gotta say, that is much better than a suicide pact. Why did this season have to have the most depressing topic of all? Why couldn't we just go back to the good old days with stabbing people with ninja equipment? AJ attempts to start a fire, but is unsuccessful. The Zohan receives an explosive from an unknown sponsor. If that picture says anything, it's the ghost of Pira. <laughs> Here you go! 
blow someone the frick up. I do things and stuff, sees a fire, but stays hidden. Darth Yoda is unable to start a fire and sleeps without warmth. Can anyone make a fire? <laughs> <laughs> I say that with epic mob attempts to start a fire, but is unsuccessful. Okay, that was, the nighttime wasn't that bad. Nobody, nobody died. Also, I just, I see two people on the side of my screen and I'm, I'm looking at you because I'm scared. AJ severely slices the serving gamer with a sword. <laughs> oh, AJ. What? Oh God, I almost fell backwards. All he wanted to do was make an old timey bomb. I don't even think he was going to let it go. I think he was just going to hold it. This is my baby right here. Oh boy. Well, there goes another one. AJ surviving. I imagine he just uses pop tool stick. Just ah. <laughs> Evil Pickle Rick steals from Roxanne while she isn't looking. Communism, am I right? <laughs> <laughs> Matthew Trapp questions his sanity. Matt Tardis discovers a cave. Knox steals from Vad the Vampire while he isn't looking. No, Knox. Not his hatchet! He looks so cute with his hatchet! Ready to hatch away at people instead of drinking their blood or, you know, T-Rex parts. Like right here. Sierra does stalks Froggy Otaku? Wow, game! Don't gotta make my freaking subscribers creepy. He probably just wants to give her that hand. Hey, I wanna hold the puppy. Hey, can I hold the puppy? Nope. You don't want the dog. It's my dog. Darth Yoda and the Zohan split up for supplies and resources. See, this first day has got me on the edge. Every time I see two pictures together, I instantly think to myself before I read this, he's going to do it again. He's ready. Zohan, run. Run. The only thing he wants to split is your spleen with his ninja equipment. I do things and stuff, see smoke rising in the distance, but decides not to investigate. Epic Mob explores the arena, and Robert receives a hatchet from an unknown sponsor. It was Knox. The unknown sponsor was Knox. I smell an alliance. Uh-oh! Hey guys, guess what? Event time! Which probably means if you were hoping your character was not going to die, they're probably going to die at this very moment. We have seen things like floods and packs of dogs. Packs of dogs that actually ruins friendships. That's right. John got killed in that season by a pack of dogs. Ain't still a sore topic for him. <laughs> oh God, here we go. I do things and stuff kill Froggy and Taku in order to utilize body of water safety. What? Oh, it's a, you couldn't have let her have it. Oh, God. Well, oh, jeez. All right, we got another death. Froggy Otaku not making it. You could have shared the water. I get it. You do things and stuff, which includes obtaining water. But did you really have to kill the innocent girl? You know what's who's still alive? That. You know that dog's out for blood. It's just like, I do things and stuff, wins the tournament. But the dog rules the world. Holy shit! AJ falls uh, to the ground but kicks Robert hard enough to then push him into the fire. It's, it's scary because isn't the first thing AJ did is fall over? Or was that my joke? No, I feel that was my joke. <laughs> Oh, God, Robert just went ablaze. Oh, God. But does that mean AJ's dead, too? I think they're both dead. I think AJ just took Robert down with him. Guess we'll find out. Roxanne survives. Matthew Trapp survives. Epic Mob survives. Matt Tardis survives. Sarah Dust kills the Zohan in order to utilize a body of water. By God. Wasn't he a part of that, like, pack of people who killed everybody? Guys, that pack's scaring me. That beginning pack that killed the other three? Was Sierra Dust, it was the mob, and somebody else. I don't remember. I'll check the data. But it seems 
that pact is truly an alliance for victory. Zohan just got freaking burned up. He sees, he sees Pyrrha in heaven now. Ryan, don't laugh at your stupid joke. No! <laughs> Pickle Rick falls on the ground and kicks Fad into the fire! No! Fad was my favorite conceptual character with his T-Rex body and his hatchet. No! Does that mean Pickle Rick's dead too? Nox survives and Lord Darth Yoda survives. Five cannons have gone off, folks, which means Disturbed Gamer, Froggy Otaku, Robert Smith, the Zohan, and Vad the Vampire are no more. Let us see the stats here, folks. Oh, okay, so that means AJ and Pickle Rick are alive. They are just hideous murderers. <laughs> but at this point, I don't... Uh, I was about to say, uh... There aren't any innocent people, but that's not totally true. Nox and uh, Roxanne are two... Uh, oh, and Matt are two people with no blood on their hands. Uh, oh, Matthew Trap. Was it Trap? Matthew. My God. They're all still alive. Seer Dust Mob and Matthew Trap. Can they be stopped or will these three people take the top of the top? We're going to find out. The final ten, folks. Let's see who's going to make it. All right, Ryan. And read. AJ thinks about winning. <laughs> I think AJ thought about winning when he freaking kicked someone with his popsicle stick right in the far. There you go. Sierra Dust tries to sing himself to sleep. Oh, it's nighttime. I forgot. I didn't read that. I do things and stuff. Thinks about home. <gasps> Epic mob taints knocks food, killing her. I should mention, by the way, I made it her because the picture, I thought it was a female. I don't know if the person is a female or a male. Probably isn't one. I don't know. But I had to make a decision. Well, let me put everyone's question marks. <gasps> but the freaking Alliance of Destruction strikes again. This is, this is getting, this is getting sad, folks. This is getting sad. Even though I know, I mean, I can't just have a, a Hunger Games where everyone survives. <laughs> I mean, I guess you could. That'd be fun. Darth Yoda receives the explosive from an unknown sponsor. Matthew Trapp attempts to start a fire, but is unsuccessful. <gasps> oh, never mind. <laughs> Roxanne and Matt sleep in shifts. I thought we were going to get our first uh, nookie of the of the season. I once had sex with Granny Beeball. It's my proudest moment of my life. <laughs> <laughs> Evil Pango Red cries himself to sleep. <laughs> Man, even his freaking comments in this game are memes. The feast. The cornucopia is replenished with food, supplies, and weapons and memorials of family. Uh-oh. 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 There's a lot of there's a lot of people on the screen. Evil Pickle Rick, Matt Tardis, and Matthew unsuccessfully ambush Cyrodus, the AJ Pony, and I do stuff who kill them instead. Mm, mm, mm. See, this is this is interesting, folks, because that was that that was a war between two people of the original alliance. Matt and Sierra Dust. He tried to team up with Matt, the double Matt connection, and Evil Pickle Rick. I feel like what happened here was they were ambushing, and then someone, not going to mention names, uh, at some point mentioned something to do with communism. And got him killed. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, what smells like tears? Communism! Oh God! Roxanne sets Epic Mob on fire with a Molotov. Wow! I did not see this coming. <laughs> oh boy! All right. So that means now there is only one left of the alliance. There is no more alliance. Matthew and Mob are now dead. Sierra Dust, the only one left. 
Lord Darth Vader decides not to go to the feast. That was a good decision, Yoda. A good decision. <laughs> the third day, Lord Darth Vader hunts for other tributes. Oh, God. Sira Dust tries to sleep through the entire day. <laughs> he injures himself. It's fine, bud. Roxanne was able to juggle some chainsaws. You'll be fine. Roxanne picks some flowers. Well, you know what they say. Once you light someone on fire, the best way to cure your insanity is picking flowers. I do things and stuff. Dies trying to escape the arena. Ooh. That means six people have fallen, folks. Knox, Evil Pickle Rick, Matt, Matthew, Mob, and I do things and stuff have all fallen. Which means we are, folks, on the final four. The final four contestants. Ladies and gentlemen, AJ, Yoda, Sierra Dust, and Roxanne have all made it to the finals. One of these four will be up there in the Hall of Fame of Hunger Games. Let's find out. Also, I didn't realize that AJ murdered five people. <laughs> Well, I mean, it's not compared to Cyrodos with seven kills, which I think might be the most deaths or kills in a season. I could be mistaken. It's been a while since I've rewatched it. So, ladies and gentlemen, let's end this season with a bang. And let's find out who the newest champion is of season four. AJ and Yoda, let's talk about tributes still alive. <laughs> AJ and Yoda plotting. Plotting against Roxanne and Sierra Dust. Roxanne climbs a tree to rest. Roxanne's smart. She's like, what would a squirrel do? <gasps> Nap. Sierra Dust dies of dysentery? It is a common side effects, folks. If you if you kill seven people, you have a 99% chance of getting dysentery. That's just how it goes, folks. Oh, Sierra Dust. And the final member of the Alliance falls. Oh, man. His freaking reign of terror was one to remember, though. Roxanne questions her sanity. AJ tries to sleep through the entire day. <laughs> didn't, didn't he do that in the last one? No, it was probably someone else. That was someone else. Yoda makes a slingshot. Wow, one person down, folks. Sierra Dust falls on the fourth day. But here we go. Who wins? AJ lets Roxanne into her shelter. Did I make AJ a girl too? I probably did. I don't remember. <laughs> Darth Yoda climbs a tree to rest. What is with people in their trees? AJ receives a hatchet from an unknown sponsor. Roxanne shoots a poison dart right into Darth Vader's neck. Slowly killing him. Oh, man. Oh, boy. Roxanne ain't playing around anymore. She's like, listen, I lit a man on fire. I lit a man on fire. I ain't going down. And she shoots a dart right into Darth Yoda. My God, the king of the ninja weapons has fallen. Oh, guys, we are down to the last two. It's AJ versus Roxanne. There can only be one, folks. Let's see who wins. Oh, I guess we gotta look at... Rest in peace, Darth Yoda. Your ninja ways will never be forgotten. AJ <laughs> 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 attempts to climb a tree but falls to death. <laughs> <laughs> that is funny on multiple levels folks one it's an ice cream bar ain't got no hands it just <laughs> it just splat against a tree and then fell backwards and just ice cream everywhere and then just the the gta also the thing that made me laugh the most is the fact that multiple people have climbed a tree so it felt like aj was like it seems to like climbing trees. I should try to climb a tree. <laughs> but folks, that means the 
winner of the Fan Royale is Roxanne Benson, the winner and the new champion of Hunger Games. Congratulations. Man, oh man, what a battle. There it is, folks. Here's the scoreboards. Oh, oh, DFPG. You really did get the Ryan treatment. <laughs> <laughs> Feels bad, man. Feels bad, I know. So who got the most kills there? It has to be Cyrodus, right? It seems so, yeah. It seems that he was the most kills, who got the most kills. Anyways, folks, I hope you guys had fun doing this video. I know I sure did. Uh, that makes me sound like a, an insane person. <laughs> but yeah, guys, I hope you had fun. Don't freaking find the person who killed you and freaking write nasty comments unless you're joking. I don't want to see some real sass down there. Unless it is hashtag sorry DFPG. <laughs> or hashtag you get that tree, AJ. And there are the final statistics, folks. Kill-wise, wow, AJ coming in second place with deaths. He second place in, in both areas right there. District 10 getting first place. Well, folks, like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed this season of Hunger Games. And if you're wondering what the next season will be, a Ruby Hunger Games. Which means I am going to take my most loved and most hated characters of Ruby. And they're going to go in a death battle to see who of the Ruby characters is the best and will be the champion for season 5. I don't know when that season is going to come out, but I'm hoping soon. Anyways, folks, I hope you have a great day. And I'll see you next time. And thanks for watching. And I'm sorry to all the, to the 23 people who died. <laughs> See you next time, everybody, and congratulations, Roxanne, for being Season 4 Champion.